What you do is get yourself a tray, put it on the hob, get it reasonably hot. I want a sluice of extra virgin, and I've got some lovely pancetta. Just lay this pancetta straight onto the tray, and as soon as it's kind of reasonably crisp and golden, we can pull it out. Now, to go with it, what I've done here is I've just taken out some stalks. So what I want to do is I want to sort of scold. You know how you put tomatoes in water to blanch it? 40 seconds, skin comes off. I'm going to do that, but without water, I'm going to do it in the oven. Herb-wise, six or so bay leaves, oregano, off the stick, and then rosemary. I want to get these tomatoes, sit them on top of the oil. Brilliant. Once we've done that, this can go straight back in the oven, just to sort of blister the tomatoes. Now, I've got these lovely sausages here and just get a little bit of olive oil and just rub it all around your sausage. Lovely. So, I can hear by now the tomatoes have had a fair bit of action. Three, four minutes in this oven. What I want to do now, you can let them cool down a bit if you want or use some tongs, but I like to just sort of pinch off the skins. So, literally just pull them off. And then just, with a spoon, just mix it up. And then these sausages, which have been sort of tossed in the oil, just can be dangled in and around, and you want to just push them in between your tomatoes. All I want to do is get a little bit of garlic. I'm not going to peel them. I'm just going to put them in and around. And that's sort of it. A little drizzle of olive oil. And then a little seasoning with some salt and pepper. The best bit of the dish now is the slow cooking. So I'm going to put that in about 180 Celsius, about 350 Fahrenheit, and I'll turn the sausages maybe once or twice in that time, and it will be delish. Come on! Fantastic. We definitely need something to, to mop up all those lovely juices. It could be polenta, it could be rice, but um, I think this. Get a nice bit of bread, cut it up like that, give it a nice rip up and then get the lovely tomatoes in on top of that bread like that get a few nice sausages look at that all the juice at the bottom to finish it a little bit of balsamic vinegar just a few little drips around the sauce and that is just going to mix in a real treat but that is a cracker absolute cracker